Hey guys, I'm Steve and this is Wilmer Woodworks. Today we've got an unboxing of a Craftsman 20 volt soldering iron. Stay tuned. So I picked this soldering iron up quite a while ago and I'm finally getting to using it. Uh, so I thought I'd do an unboxing for you guys just show you the components that are involved in it and a yeah, quick review on me soldering up some leads to a board and trying it out. Uh, it's just the tool only. This model is the CMC E040 which again is the tool only so you will have to supply your own 20 volt battery uh, but I've got plenty of batteries on standby. Uh, so it comes with a pen holder, the standard base, uh, the soldering iron, of course, and a, uh, a sponge and a sponge reservoir. Everything's pretty neatly packed in the box. Uh, I do have a fully charged 4 amp hour battery, uh, so I will be using that for soldering today. Uh, the pen holder is just a friction fit here in the top. And like I said, it does come with that sponge, that sponge reservoir. Now I'm going to try to do some more projects uh, moving forward that use microcontrollers and Arduino boards and things like that. So I should be getting more use out of this soldering iron than I have in the past since <laughs> I'm just now getting around on unboxing it. Uh, the wire that is included with this, I believe it's four feet and it's more than enough than what I need for uh, for using around my shop. Uh, I have used this since uh, out in the field and this is really great as well when you're not close to a power source. Uh, there is a only one knob on this unit that has uh, the power indicator and it didn't take very long for this to heat up at all actually. Uh, only about a, maybe a minute, two minutes uh, tops. So I'm going to practice here. Now I am not very good at soldering. I'll be the first to tell you I'm not really sure. On, I mean I've soldered a few projects here and there. Uh, so please do not take this as a how to solder video. This is just me testing out the unit. Uh, so here I'm just putting a little bit of solder on the board and then I'll put it on those uh, testing pins because I just didn't have any wire. I will be using these pins here. Uh, for this upcoming project that I'm putting together and that project will be in a video that I'm hoping to have released uh, here next week so be sure to stay tuned for that and if you guys like the unboxing or any of the other videos I've got out there feel free to subscribe uh, our uh, subscribers are, are jumping substantially uh, in the past couple of weeks and I do appreciate uh, and I am thankful for everybody that does subscribe. So this here, this board is a seven segment, eight digit seven segment digital display uh, that I'm putting together with a Node MCU ESP8266 uh, microcontroller. Uh, so a small little computer and uh, that has a Wi-Fi board integrated into it and basically it'll go out, it'll connect to my Wi-Fi, it'll connect to a, a YouTube API that I have set up and then it will display on this segmented uh, display how many uh, YouTube subscribers I currently have in real time and then I'm gonna put that in a shadow box and just hang it on the wall so. <laughs> My uh, my family can cheer me along as as the subscribers slowly increase. So I hope you enjoyed the unboxing. Like I said, I, I really like the way that this is put together. It seems to work out very well for me. And uh, till next time, thanks for watching. <laughs>